Hello my family members. Today we will solve a simple coding question that was asked in Accenture of Campus on 27th June 2023. I will solve the problem through Python. Can you solve through Java? If you can then comment your code, right? Okay, before starting I would request you to watch the playlist regarding previous year paper. Link is given in the description box. If you already watched then thank you. That is better for you, right? and subscribe this channel okay let's start a has purchased n apples for b and c now he wants to share all apples with his friends one apple typically weighs between 100 and 200 grams a naturally wants to protect his pulse since B and C receives an identical quantity of apples. The weight of apples they received must be also equal. A however is unable to divide an apple into multiple pieces because he is currently without a knife. If there is a fair way to distribute all the apples among his friends, let him know. Okay, actually this is the range that is 100 to 200 is the range uh, of a single apple weight right and this 100 is the weight of a single uh, it actually it is the weight of every single apple right and this is the quantity of the apple so total weight for this input will be 100 to 3 that is 300 grams right and this is 100 and 200 uh, maximum minimum range so if we check that uh, the maximum minimum weight is possible 300 right 3 into 100 it is 300 and the maximum weight is possible 3 into 200 that is 600 so uh, the weight total weight 300 is it lies between the maximum minimum if yes then then check if both of b and c are getting same quantity same weight if yes then it is a fair right actually we are defining the condition we are defining the second condition that is the lies between 100 to sorry the maximum or minimum range right so let's start with the code right def if fair right and check it is the size the quantity of apple and minimum range and maximum range and uh, each apple weight right so total weight will be total weight will be single uh, sorry quantity into single apple weight right and we will now check if minimum weight multiply by multiply by n is greater than is less than uh, the is less than or equal to total weight and also we will check that if maximum multiply by n is greater than equal to total if this then what will you do then again check if both of them that means a b a, sorry b and c are getting equal or not so total weight mod 2 is equal to is equal to 0 if yes then print yes this is a fair right this is a fair
fair distribution or else print no right print no right okay let's take input that means the driver code right uh driver code that is let's take input from the user first in minimum maximum and the weight right is equal to map now sorry list map int input input dot split okay now we'll uh sorry we don't have to take list actually okay now call the function print sorry in if fair function just calling the function will be okay if fair n m i m a and w right okay let's check i think this will be okay so 300 200 100 oh why this is showing no oh actually i should not give this right because if this fun this is satisfying then it will print right so i should not give this part okay i think now this is fair so 300 200 and 100 yes the output is right guys actually this condition was not given to us it was not defined we define this because uh, it was uh, supposed to be done by us because uh, they recommended to define a process to actually divide the apple weight between B and C, right? So, this way you can solve the problem. And you may have another coding, another explanation, another uh, coding, right? So, if you have please give me in the comment box sometimes i may also do a mistake right so if i do so then please be kind while commenting right okay thank you for today's session